Ready. Is it going down there? Yes. Oh, and the light. Oh, the light wasn't. Okay. Uh, hello, my name is Teresita Blanco, the Arts and Sister. And we're back to the sea club team, but it's a little different this time. Because I'm trying out different papers to see. Mostly because I ran out of ink paper. <laughs> So uh, I want to see how how the how the ink behaves in other types of paper. Like this one is uh, just your run of the mill classical watercolor paper. I guess you can see it doesn't warp the colors. You know everything is more or less where it's supposed to. But. Uh, but the ink doesn't spread too far, which is a double edged, which is a, like a double edged sword. Cause yeah, you have more control over the paint over the ink, but uh, the downside is that you have to use uh, more ink to to finish filling up the the paper the paper one. Huh? So yeah, it's just uh, many things to consider when uh, when trying when picking a when picking a a paint uh, when picking like a type of paper that you're gonna use to like paint the one. So yeah, so then uh, I'm gonna add some. Uh, alcohol to the background to see if it helps uh, spread the ink more without having to put too much away and I can mainly just uh, trying to preserve the pigment so that I don't have to like spend that much money on uh, alcohol inks Uh, I always do this ink card because I vented it around so they dry faster. And it also keeps, like, they stop venting it so, and it also, like, gets rid of the alcohol scent because it, it just uh, dissipates it faster from, like, your work area. paper the like it works a bit in one warping means that it gets like a little bendy I mean I, I mean I guess I should have anticipated that and like put like tape on it or something but I'm like, mm. that's no fun I'd rather just see the happy accidents that happen. Not about for us. Uh -huh. Yeah, it doesn't spread that much, though.
That's the yellow, right? Yeah. Yellow-ish. Stronger yellow. Yeah. Especially as it dries. Yeah. Like it comes in as orange and then dries uh, yellow. Yeah. This is something you gotta consider when doing
yeah. Also very interesting and uh, it comes out very in control in watercolor paper. And you see how big of a difference the paper makes? Kiss, I'm asking you a question. Yes, I see it. <laughs> And if you want to, you can make the tentacles a little longer. Well, they're not really tentacles, they're like uh, squishy porcupine spikes, like the... Because they're like sea slugs, so then, uh, you know, sea slugs are squishy. You can hear the the bing. The neighbors not cutting the lawn. Okay, sometimes I like to open the door to like bring into the video the sounds of the garden, but like uh, now the only sound in the garden right now is like. Meh. Bye-bye and God bless.